Hi, I'm Greta. And I'm Claudia, and welcome to Knitters and Critters, where we talk about Critical Role Campaign 3. Three. Yeah, we're on episode 44, which is very aptly titled Body Basement Belligerence. <laughs> <laughs> it's our first X rating. <laughs> yes, NC 17. Yeah. yeah. What the hell is wrong with the Bell Cells? <laughs> Like, I feel like they all just turned a corner mentally and now they're just like the dirty old uncles. Of... <laughs> yeah, yeah. That, that I love Marisha, like, <laughs> opening her shirt yeah. and I'm like, okay. Like, what we're... horrors await underneath Laudna's shirt? Because I can't imagine it's anything, yeah. you know, enticing. <laughs> and boobs of dread. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah that, that was a very interesting choice. Yes. So I think we were all, I wasn't expecting it to be like Odahan Ghouls or Delaf's people upstairs in the house. I was really expecting it to be like the Judicators and right. people from Vasselheim. Uh, but no, it didn't turn out to be that way. Yeah. <laughs> like, I mean, I suppose that's one way of trying to use your words to get out of a situation. <laughs> just confuse the opponents into yeah. submission. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, it works man. sometimes. Yeah. yeah. And then Fern turning into a huge freaking Clydesdale yeah. in not, a tiny basement. Not, it's like her way of learning from that is to turn into a slightly less small horse <laughs> before leaving the house. Yeah, because she blo <laughs> was blocking people to getting in and out. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Fern. Ferny, Fern, Fern. <laughs> <laughs> Bless your heart, you perfect little cinnamon roll. <laughs> yeah, she's adorable. What can we say? We love her. Yeah, I liked the new camera angles uh oh yeah, yeah during the battle like they had i think in post-production they had yeah. gone in and kind of shown you from the mini perspective yeah i thought that was neat that's really smart i'm glad that, that that's a good i didn't think i even yeah. noticed that and i'm gonna have to take an eye the next time we have a battle map out yeah i i like that because yeah. it's sort of i mean it puts it in perspective mm -hmm. you know to see like how big is this space and you know how many exits are being blocked by your enemies so yeah yeah i like that or your allies in the case of the giant <laughs> clydesdale <laughs> but well, um well, kind of getting worried about fcg they were saying that they're uh they keep taking their those... internal dial it keeps going towards the red yeah so that Ooh, doesn't that seem... is not good. Yeah, that is not good. I don't I think, think they need yeah. murder bot right now. When they snap, it's just not gonna be okay. Yeah. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Um. I thought it was really smart that they took that guy hostage. Yeah. The mage. Mm -hmm. Um. Because that's not always something that they think about doing. <laughs> you know. Usually a, they've already murdered. Yeah. Them. Usually they've by the time they're like, everybody. oh, we should have kept them to ask. Them or things. they try to ask questions on site. And luckily they, you know, I think Matt had given them a couple hints, like, you know, you're in a residential neighborhood, people are going to call the cops. <laughs> so luckily they, like, internalized that hint and took the guy and scattered Yeah. Um, yeah. to, a, you know, a handy, empty warehouse. As you do. As, as one does, yeah. Mm -hmm. But I really liked the idea of, first of all, they finally gave, like, the other group a name other than just, like, Odahan Thule people. Like, yeah. The Ruby, Ruby Vanguard. Ruby is Vanguard, that what it is? yeah. Great name. Yeah. <laughs> and they want to set Perdathos free. Yeah. That they is... definitely got the confirmation that that was their grand plan. That is just not, not no. something that needs to happen. No. no. It's just mm -mm. so, like, like, okay, I understand that the little minion dude is brainwashed enough to believe that this is a good idea but really you think a god killer is just gonna up and say thanks for letting me free i'm just gonna eat these people and go like right yeah no yeah no they're not they're not of uh, course oof. the solstice is one week away oh my god yeah that yeah. floored me yeah a week week and a half tops like, yeah yeah, Charge. it's it's yeah. it's happening and it's in their faces and yeah. holy crap! And they got to make a choice. Mm -hmm. uh, I really hope they go to the Feywild because if Mori is able and she doesn't, it does sound like she could screw with the timeline a little bit. Mm -hmm. It could give them the time they need to, you know, infiltrate the Unsealy Court and you know dismantle that machine before yeah. coming home without losing too much time. But no one has mentioned. Yusuf Ayat, or the fact that the Unsealy Court is still hunting for Fern and her family. Yeah. Like, 
have they just forgotten? Or I could see, like, Fern kind of forgetting. Yeah. Like, oh, you was yeah. really my friend. She just doesn't know it yet. Or they just don't <laughs> know it yet. <laughs> yeah. But, like, everyone, like, just... I know. Mentally blanking on that. I know. Mm. Um, yeah. Yeah. So that's kind of going to be a mess. That is going to be a mess. Well, and I also Oof. kind of wonder, has you still been following them? Because they kind of made it sound like they had a way of tracking the Bell's house. I think it, that's more the case. I don't think they are maybe literally following them, but I do think they are keeping tabs on them. Maybe, maybe they, I mean, they have allies or... or or sooner or later, they're going to find, oh, what is this button in my coat pocket? You know, and it's like, oh. Yeah. Whoops. Yeah, yeah what they did to Odhan Thule is what you, you did to them, too, yeah. probably. Yeah. Mm. That seems like an unfortunate oversight that's about to bite probably in the next two or three episodes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because Matt Matt will bring things back, too. Yeah. He well, will circle back he will circle and pivot. Back. Yeah. Hopefully yeah. they're able, because I'm, I'm assuming they're going to be able to, They'll be meeting you in the in the Feywild because I'm like ninety percent sure that's where that's going. Hopefully, they're able to like bring you to the dark side because they need allies. They do. Like, yeah, they have Plain Rider Rin. That'll be great. The Grim Verity, though, they're not gonna help fight. They're just there for research. Like, yeah, yeah, no. and they, yeah. Mm. I hope they bring. Um, I hope Dorian is able to make it. I really do. Come on. Because it is feeling like the Bell's House is up against way too much. And that I think they so. are not prepared to yeah, fight. They're not. They're absolutely not. I have. They're still I love like, them. Yeah. But I have zero confidence. I have zero confidence in them. <laughs> yeah. I do Fern feel will like transform they're... into something that is completely inappropriate. Yeah. And like, yeah. Yeah. Imogen, I think, will get a couple of good shots off. But I also worry about how, what 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 it's going to do to her to see her mom in the flesh, working with the Ruby Vanguard, mm-hmm. and what happens if she can't convince her mom to switch sides? Yeah. Because I feel like that's what she's hoping for. Right. That she's hoping she's got an inside man to help out when the cards are inevitably down. Right. I'm not sure that she does. I don't think she does. I mean, somebody who willingly walks away from you and yeah. hasn't seen you in 30 years. And and not only does that, but joins, like, the bad guys. Yeah. Like, unrepentantly. Yeah. Like, yeah, I don't want you involved in them, but I'm still going to be joining. And Yeah. yeah. No. I don't think Imogen is going to mean as much to her mom as she thinks yeah. she will. Which is heartbreaking. But oh, yes, but... Yeah. Mm. There's a lot of drama up ahead, folks. What do you think is going to happen next? Hopefully, are you think they're going to go Feywild, Shadowfell, or straight to the Hellcatch Valley? Drop us, drop a comment below and let us know. Yes. Um, I think that's it for us for this episode. I As so always, too. like and subscribe to our channel. We really appreciate it. And uh, bye. <laughs>